Welcome to Skytron's in-service review module for the Hercules Model 6700 series surgical table. This video will educate and inform the viewer on the care and safe operation of the table. Potential operators as well as assigned housekeeping and biomedical personnel are required to fully review this video as well as the operator's manual before attempting to operate, clean, or perform preventative maintenance. In addition, prior to placing a patient onto the surgical table, operating room personnel should inspect the table each day to ensure it is functioning properly. The maximum lifting capacity of the 6700 series table is 1,200 pounds, and the maximum articulation capacity is 1,000 pounds. Understand that patient weight capacity considers the patient to be in a supine or prone position with the patient's weight evenly distributed across the table top and that the brakes remain locked at all times. If the patient is set up in reverse orientation with their head on the leg section and feet on the head section, the table's maximum weight capacity is reduced to 500 pounds. Operation of the 6700 series table is accomplished via the use of the handheld pendant control, which is typically operated at the head end by the anesthesiologist or nurse anesthetist. It is backlit for low light conditions, such as those required for minimally invasive surgery. All of the articulation movements for the 6700 series table can be controlled by the handheld control. The table is also equipped with emergency backup control functions in the event of power outage or pendant control failure. Control switches are located under the access door cover in the table base. Simply push the desired emergency switch in the appropriate direction to operate table functions. The emergency brake release control knob is located on the side of the table base. Turning the knob clockwise will release the brakes, making it possible to reposition the table in an emergency. If the emergency brake release is used for any reason, the brakes must be reactivated by first rotating the control knob counterclockwise, then pressing the brake unlock button to recycle the brake system. The head section is equipped with a quick release positioning bar located under the front of the head section. Pulling back on the release bar will allow the section to pivot up 60 degrees or down 90 degrees in 15 degree increments. Simply release the bar to lock the head section in place. The head section can also be removed by loosening a pair of locking knobs by rotating each knob counterclockwise, then pulling it backward off the back section. Head section pins are approximately 6 inches long. For tall surgical patients, the head section can be loosened, pulled back up to 3 inches, and retightened for additional table length. It can also be removed completely and inserted into the leg section to provide additional leg support. Be sure it is secure by tightening the knobs below the leg section. Both back and leg sections on the 6700 series table are removable as clinical situations dictate. Position the table at waist height and make sure it is level before attempting to remove a section. Also, remove any x-ray tops if they are present on the table. To remove the back or leg section, locate the release levers under the desired section and depress upward while pulling the section off the pins. Be prepared to support 22 pounds of weight when removing each section. For safety, once the leg section is removed, press and hold the leg down button on the pendant control until both leg pins come to a complete stop in their full downward position. To replace the back section, slide it back onto the pins until an audible click is detected from both pins. 
Pull back to be sure it is positively locked onto the table. To replace the leg section, press the leg up button on the pendant control and raise the pins to their highest position. Slide the leg section onto the pins until the audible click is detected from both pins. Be sure to pull back on the leg section to be sure it is positively locked onto the table. Leg and back sections are labeled for proper orientation. The leg section cannot be installed on the back section pins. The 6700 series table top can rotate up to 210 degrees, which is an ideal feature for many surgical procedures. To rotate the tabletop, release the handle by rotating it counterclockwise. The tabletop can then be rotated 210 degrees or anywhere in between. However, for positioning beyond 30 degrees, a support rod is recommended. The support rod must be used for 90 degree positioning to prevent the surgical table from tipping or becoming potentially unstable. To lock or tighten, rotate the top rotation handle clockwise until it seats snugly. Do not over tighten. Always be sure to lock the table once in the desired position to prevent unwanted table rotation. For patients exceeding 200 pounds, be sure the appropriate number of support staff are available to safely rotate the patient into final position.